kind of right now, you know what I'm saying? Like I say, I'm saying, got the, got the fucking, um, the ounce of the, uh, rubber to roll, you know what I'm saying? Raspberry leaf, I mean, but still, just like, gotta go through the process, process of, like, making it, I mean? So sometimes you kind of have, like, something real special in store, but it's like, you still gotta go through the process of making it, I mean? And then, mm, sometimes you can even have a great idea, but sometimes you have to just kind of, um, do it the right way for the best, for the best result. I mean, you can't really always just do everything at once. I mean, kind of just kind of take it step by step, but just kind of have a have the vision and even just I'm saying have like a game plan. You don't always go the same exact, but I'm saying just don't always try to do everything at once. I mean, but then um, and then sometimes like right now it's kind of like beyond just having that and having to make it. It's kind of like, it's not like super messy because it's very spread out. So it's not like, it's not really cluttered. It's just, it's kind of messy in this motherfucker right now. But even just the confidence, I mean, kind of like feeling, um, it's messy as heck and it's not really, it's not really that comfortable even right now being as messy. But it's like, just the confidence, I mean, um, yeah, knowing I, 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 just being confident, I can clean up very well. Like, I can clean up extremely well. So it's like, is not really <clears throat> just knowing that. I mean, like sometimes you can kind of that's that's kind of how you can kind of have peace, like in the chaos. It's interesting. You can have peace in the chaos just by I'm saying just knowing your ability. I mean, of it isn't, it's not really tough to clean up. I mean, huh? I might do that, like, <laughs> but yeah, you know what I'm saying like it's not. It's, it's, it's very simple to clean up. I mean, so just um, <clears throat> having the confidence, just in the chaos, whatever, just because you, you, I just don't feel like doing it necessarily right now. But um, just even just the confidence, no, I can. That it just it's, it's a certain level of peace in it. I mean, so yeah. And really, at any point. I mean, sometimes it's just not. It's not even really. <clears throat> I'm gonna say beneficial, but beneficial to do certain stuff. I mean. At a certain time, because sometimes it really is like it's not about procrastination. It's more so. Um, I really, I really might get to it really soon. I'm just saying, like, it's just, it kind of can be gradual, but it's more like um, it'd be kind of beneficial to do it more so like um sooner than later. Then sometimes it's just like I'm saying like um, I'd rather just because it can be it can actually be actually um, enjoyable. Even I'm saying like do something like it's some medium or whatever it's cleaning up, I mean, so sometimes you just want to be more so just in the, just in the right headspace to do something like that, I mean, like, something as simple as, I'm saying, getting a lighter, I mean, just, <laughs> it's just, yeah, being in the mood of doing it, I mean, and then just, I mean, you kind of realize you don't even, Sometimes you, you feel like you need something, you don't really need it. As much as you thought you, you did not need it. I mean, just as much as you thought you did, you did. And then a lot of stuff, like this one, for instance, I'm going to kind of add out something like this, this mixture right here, for instance. I mean, I kind of, yeah, I didn't see the bottom, but, but um, yeah. It's like a, it's like a, I call it kind of like a natural Viagra smoke. I mean, natural Viagra smoke. Natural Viagra smoke. I mean, because it's got the, it's got the watermelon tea in it. But it's kind of like, the, you know, kind of how I used to do it. Uh, let me see if I got it right here. You kind of see me doing it in the fucking, um, it was in the dark, you know what I'm saying? Like the video was last night, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, I got, kind of got different, different, different teas. It has a few different teas in it. Like, you know what I'm saying, like the tea bags, I mean, like this kind of stuff. And then, <clears throat> just noticing it was kind of <clears throat> interesting that I actually didn't notice. I said another thing. Like, the camel milk, the camel milk tea I used to do wasn't really the best to make more so, more than half and half. But then I was supposed to snap this with up. I was like eight and eight and stuff like that. But then um, the white one is actually like a different texture. It's more so it actually is better to do I mean, that way. So it was pretty cool. <clears throat> so sometimes it's like, <clears throat> you'll be like, um, sometimes like the lack of certain stuff, you'll learn how to be more creative. You know what I mean? So 
for instance, like sometimes you know what I'm saying, and this you you, you, you kind of you kind of when you start to learn I mean success, you'll be more confident. Just honestly, in not succeeding. I mean, because you actually learn you actually learn more from failure than success. I mean, uh, I can kind of explain that, but it might be a little wordy, so I might not. But basically, just you learn more from failure. Um, if a person if a person fails a lot, I mean. And and end up and end up getting success. They'll they more so they'll understand. I mean, um, the formula. I mean, of success as opposed to someone who just jumps into something <clears throat> has instant success. You know, no matter how long it lasts. I mean, it could last. We'll say twenty years. I mean, but it. It could last a year. It could last five years. But you whatever, how long it lasts. <clears throat> if they have instant success and just <coughs> are always successful, but then when they do, you mean hit a hit a stumbling block or whatever, even just a hard time and eventually like, it fails. It's like they don't they don't know they don't even know how they they don't even know the, what they did to succeed because it was just they just always succeeded. So they don't even know how to. How to succeed, really? I'm saying, if you know what I mean, like that's it, it's funny, but that's I, I was thinking about that like last night, like maybe in bed. But it's like yeah, like that's what I really feel like. I mean, because I kind of it kind of made me a certain way to I would say just be select. Like I was kind of explaining earlier, like, to be select when I was younger. So it did make me a certain type of way, but I feel like my my feeling with quote on my quote on quote feeling with women. I mean. Made me actually more so understand even why I was select when I was more so select, and then even just made me way more select, but also just more so just um wise. I mean, I wouldn't have gained sexual dis- discipline um, if I was just if I, I mean, I just mean even just sexual discipline in the point of what I'm saying like picking um quality over quantity, stuff like that. I mean just so yeah, just certain stuff. I wouldn't I wouldn't just wouldn't have learned as I just, that's my point. I just wouldn't have learned as much. I mean like some certain times when certain when certain stuff just comes so natural to someone, they don't they can't really they, it's not even that they can't teach it, they can't teach about it as much, but also they just can't um they don't they they, they might not have as many um Tools, I mean, I'll say up their sleeve, just you know, just they would not, might not be as <clears throat> as great as they could be if they, if they didn't have. I mean, if it wasn't if it wasn't just so natural to them, I mean, if they actually had, I mean, some struggles with certain stuff, I mean, mm. but the, the reason I do say I'm saying I'm, I'm <clears throat> I just. I feel like when I I don't really be super social, but I can I, I can feel a certain level of select selectness and like that. But it really is. It's really because um, the perceived, I mean, failing with women, but also um, I actually know why I was failing with women too. I actually know exactly why I was failing with women, but also it's really it was it was actually on purpose, but not so much on purpose. But um. I can also see why I can, why I, why I'm more so select now, but also I'm just really. But yeah, like I say, it's because it's because of the one check. I wasn't really studying. I wasn't studying chicks or whatever you want to call them. I mean, to to get chicks per se. I mean, it was more so a byproduct, just knowing how to get chicks. I, mean, I was studying. Chicks, because it was more so my my thing. I was just more like I said. I was just more. <laughs> it was just more like it resonated more with me to like study chicks, like on the red pill type of stuff, like that. More so than like a relationship coach. You feel me? Or like you know, I mean, like you know, someone like um. I mean, I don't know. Just like yeah, you know, what I mean? you know what I mean. More like more like um sensitive type shit. I mean, so it was just more so just resonated with me more. But I, I what I'm saying is I learned how to. More so about chicks in general, but from actually 
focusing more so on one participant. Yeah, it should just resonate, resonate even more so. <laughs>